kita And we're back to playing Danganronpa V3. <clears throat> I feel like I'm missing something. I should investigate a little more. What button am I supposed to be pressing? <laughs> Not that one. Not that one. Investigating. Investigating. Oh, I guess it is. The moving bookcase is closed right now. Well, why is it on auto? How do I take it off of auto? No. Stop being on auto. <laughs> oh, wait. That might tell me. Mode R1. I don't think that takes- oh, I guess it does. And press that button though. Weird. Maybe you accidentally pressed it, and that's what made it. No, I pressed it after I saw it. Oh. I don't know. Removing it is fine, but won't your receiver go off when you move it? No. No, it's alright. You can turn it off? Yes, I made sure to switch it off on the way down here. I thought the mastermind could still be inside, and I didn't want the to alert them. Smart thinking. Let's see if you're on Suichi. Pretty sure I don't need to tell this, you this, but shouldn't we investigate around Taro's body? No, it's fine. I can do it. My mind was set, and I started to walk toward Rantara's body. Oh, wait. I the last I time I saw Rantaro, he was alive and well. Mm. Why did Rantaro die here? What do you mean, die here? I mean, if Rantaro was the one who moved the bookcase, that would mean he came all the way over here after the bookcase opened. He moved away from the hidden door to this spot. Why would he do that? And there's no trace of his body being moved. It doesn't add up. You've gotten pale. Although I guess that's normal. You, we have to investigate a body after all. The body of someone who was alive and talking to us just a little while ago. It's okay. Really. 
Well, we just have to do our best. Not just for Antara's sake, but also so we can avenge him. <coughs> what? I don't know. You were looking at the screen for some reason. And so we can protect everyone else. We have to defeat the mastermind who's... Okay. Orchestrating this whole thing. Um, Kaede, I'll help you in any way I can. I'll support you for this investigation. I'm sort of a detective after all. Sort of. You are a detective, remember? Okay. Ah, right. Ooh, what's this? That's a... what's that? That's a put The bloody shot put ball is on the ground. Oh, well, it got him in the head. This shot put ball, uh, could it be? Yeah, it's, yeah, it's definitely... it definitely came from the warehouse on the first floor. There's blood all over it. That's the murder weapon, right? I don't see anything else that could could have been used. The shot itself is heavy. You should have to be very, very, fairly strong to use it as a weapon. Fairly strong, huh? Bloody shot put ball. I know we need to exam because he was standing. Um, well, yeah, but he's turned yeah. over, so. I know we need to examine this. His body. His body, but I'm not yeah, sure so where to start. Like it's okay, I can do it. Shuichi showed no hesitation as he began to investigate, mm. examine Rintara's body. There's blood on the back of his head, and it looks like a pretty deep wound. It's consistent with blunt force trauma. I don't see any other injuries. The Monokuma file is accurate. This must be the fatal wound. So we can trust the Monokuma file. Yes, for now. Shuichi then stuck his hand on into Rintaro's pocket. Wait, what are you doing? I'm checking what he has on his person. There might be a clue. If we're going to do this, we have to be thorough and I told you I would support you after all. How can you say that with so much con confidence? Come on, Kaede. Pull yourself together. Rintaro had it in had in his possession the key to his room and the student handbook monopad. The monopad is definitely his, and it's exactly the same model as ours. He didn't have a card key on him. That's what I was thinking, but he didn't have it. Then Rantaro really wasn't the mastermind. If he was a mastermind, he wouldn't have come here without the card key. So, with what we know now, that is the most likely possibility. Why was Rantaro here if he wasn't the mastermind? I have no idea. Rantaro's belongings. What else did he have on? Are you okay? No, His key. Oh. Kaede, are you okay? Uh, we've finished investigating the body. Let's get back t and get out of here for now, okay? Sorry. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, sorry. I don't get why she was... Blood was making her feel sick. Why did Rintaro come to the library? It seems likely that he is not the mastermind. What reason did he have for coming here? I'm guessing it had something to do with what Rantaro mentioned earlier. <clears throat> it's not about outfoxing everyone in this killing game. 
It's about ending the game itself. That's the real goal. Hmm. Ending the game itself. Kind of sucks that he's the... Then it's possible he noticed the hidden door in the library, just like we did. Huh? Uh, I said it's kind of weird that he died first. That's weird. Yeah, it's kind of weird. He might have come to the same conclusion we did. That the mastermind would come here. You mean he had the same idea as with us? No way. He should have told us. We could have worked together. I collapsed to the floor, crushed by the weight of my frustration. No, he probably couldn't risk telling us. Like you said, he was suspicious of everyone. I have you, Kaede, but Rintaro didn't have anyone he could trust. That might have been the only difference between me and him. As he said that, he offered me a hand. I took his hand and firmly pulled me to my feet. Kaede, let's go. We can't waste time now. You're not going to give up, right? You're going to save everyone? Shuichi. He's right. I can't give up now. Shuichi. Thanks. I feel like I can rely on you even more. Shuichi is right. We can't give up until it's over. I can't stay depressed forever. I have to help everyone get out of here. We have to continue the investigation. We gotta find the mastermind. Moving ladder. The moving ladder I used to reorganize the books on the top of the shelf bookcase. Nothing out of the ordinary here. Globe. It's a mysterious globe. Can you turn that way? Uh, this bookcase. Tons of books. Mm. It doesn't seem as if anything has changed since we set up the cameras. Remember. The books that you stacked up haven't moved. Oh, you mean the ones I stacked to keep out people from going through the vents? Yeah, those have been left alone. Stacked books. Wait, talk to people now, I guess? Yeah. Real mouth. Well, if you're the ultimate detective, then you've got your eyes on the culprit, right? I'll leave it to you. Tell me who you think the culprit is. I don't mind if it's just an educated guess. Oh, I want to know too. I can't say anything yet. Not cool. There's someone you're a little suspicious of, right? No, there's gotta be. Jeez. But you're afraid of that. You're afraid of suspecting someone, aren't you? That's how it looks to me. But with things the way they are, wouldn't it be better to for you to suspect others more? And let me just warn you. The way the word the world works is that those who speak win, the truth can easily be twisted. In order to fix a twisted truth, you need something even more powerful. What do you mean? I mean that testimonies without evidence are powerless. Be careful. I don't feel like reading in hers. <laughs> That's true. Huh? That's so a yellow word. Fine, I'll start reading everything that has yellow words. <laughs> that motive he gave us is part of it, and so is that strange music. Oh, 
Promotional video be background music. Drafting a flowing plan with photos. Out of my way. Jeez. How is that Bitch. not doing legwork, Ben? Oh, jeez. A little bit. Not mm -hmm. that much. She doesn't have to walk around. Yeah, but it's still work. Legwork <laughs> is just okay. not walking. Maybe? Oh, okay. Um. Actually, it has to do with how the bookcase works. Pretty sure it couldn't hear you, but okay. Uh, don't care. <laughs> Whoa, it opened back up. I think they were opening it. Oh. <laughs> Wait. I thought they said that they couldn't open it. Didn't they just say that? No, they can't open, open the, the door. door. They can't open the door. Okay. Mm. Got it. I'm a little sleepy, okay? I just can't help it. Moving bookcase. You rock. Huh? Remember. Remember what? That it moves? I didn't read that. Maybe it made the shot put. We learned in to get. Oh, we leaned in to get closer look at the. Uh, I was. They put a thing in the key card. Oh. No. no. Okay. Um. No. Card your dust. This is the rear door. It's the furthest I was reading that. Why do you keep doing that? Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, um. Just because you don't want to read everything it doesn't mean I can't read a little bit. Okay. Expired? Oh, we're still missing someone? Pretty sure we clicked on everything. Oh, maybe this door? It's the front door that leads directly to the basement stairs. So you get to read an item? Well, you're not talking loud enough. I was too. If it's not in the yellow, it won't hear you. We need like a table right here. Put it right here. Yeah. Or speak louder. Mm. You can get the compute the little table. Or speak louder. That's... <sighs> I think you can hear me. <laughs> what? What? <sighs> Can I oh. Turn? oh, the vent. Yeah. 
kind of try that. The vent is open. I was I the think one you need extension cord for that. who took off the grate and left it in the duct. Extension cord. Not that one. I don't want to use that one. Mm. And I have the same thing in the extension cord for that. Um. USB cable? That one? Yeah. Uh, well, I think it's good for now. Something is in my way. Nothing to the door. No. Oh, that was in my way. <laughs> okay. Library event has been added to the truth bullet section of your monopad. Let's see. Okay, I think we've investigated the entire library now. But we still don't know anything yet. I feel like we didn't get any closer to the mastermind. The most important piece of evidence will be those photos. Once we get those, but then again, we can't just say that and do nothing. Let's keep investigating what we can. Keep investigating. That's true. Yes, I think we should collect alibis. We need to verify where everyone was during the time frame when Rantaro was killed. If that's the case, then who should we question? Mm -hmm. The six people that went down to the basement with Rantaro. Hmm. Kaito, Gonta, Maki, Tenko, Angie, and Himiko. Let's talk to them first. They should have been in the game room along with Rantaro. Let's ask them about what happened there. Okay, let's go find them. For now, let's head to the game room. Do you want to do it? Would you like to leave? Ow, my leg hurts. Whoever created that really is a weird person. Every staircase is a different color. <laughs> Every room is a different color. Mm. There is only one person here. Maki. You were in the game room when Rantara was killed, right? What were you all doing down here? Rantara Rantar was with you, right? <gasps> Am I a suspect? Oh no, that's not what I mean, meant. You should suspect me. In fact, you should be suspicious of everyone. <laughs> Someone got killed right after we all gathered here. The timing is too perfect. Then again, with the time limit so close to expiring, Maybe that's why it happened. You don't know? So just, so trust no one, Kaede, or you'll lose, got it? I can't get a read on Maki at all. She just saw a dead body, yet she's perfectly calm. It's hard to imagine her as the ultimate child caregiver. <clears throat> but why were you all here in the first place? <coughs> It was Kaito's idea. He suddenly wanted to hold a strategy meeting and gathered us together. Why gather them? 
He said we should confront Mogunokuma once the time limit expires. I don't understand. And he picked the seven people he thought would be useful in a fight. Really? But, um, I'm not sure those seven would all be useful in a fight, though. Kaito thought Himiko's magic and Angie's con connection to Atua would be useful. <laughs> but what about you, Maki? Why did he also pick the ultimate child caregiver? He just looked at me and said, yeah, you probably know how to fight. That's it, jeez. That does sound like something Kaito would do, though. But why have a strategy meeting in the game room in the basement? I don't know. Is it reading? Yeah. Beats me. Maybe Kaito figured it would be harder for Monokuma to find us here. In other words, it was just a coincidence. Maybe he just um. wanted to play spin the ball. <laughs> and what was Rentar doing at the time? Was he in the strategy meeting with you? That's true. He was at first. But then he excused himself to go to the bathroom and left on his own. <sighs> Kaito and Tenko went looking for him so we could finish the meeting before time expired. That must have happened around... You know what's weird is they didn't actually show Kaito in that picture. No. Mm -mm. Did you see Kaito in that picture? Of the six? Yeah. Oh, then it must have been my life. He was the first one down the stairs. Oh. Going to going to did arrive, but then he left and locked himself in the A V room in the back. He was in the AV room by himself. Ew. Suspicious behavior, isn't it? The two, of, the other two felt the same way. <laughs> the other Why two? Why don't you go in to the AV room? They're probably still there. Monkey's account. Ow, ow, ow. Ow, ow, ow. 